Welcome to CoolEnglish.net, a fun, interactive website for English teachers and learners. I'm John, and today I'd like to show you some Jeopardy-style games available for free on the site. Let's look at the PVSG game, or Pronunciation, Vocabulary, Spelling, and Grammar. I normally separate the students into two teams, and set a limit on how many questions there will be. Four, ten, or all sixteen. It depends on you and the time you have available to play. In this way, the game can be adapted to be played for a few minutes or for much longer. The team with the most points at the end wins, or if you're playing with an individual student, you can set a goal like 1,000 points in 6 questions, or 2,000 points in 10 questions. After that, the students choose a category and a point amount, remembering that the 100 point questions are the easiest and the 400 point questions are the hardest. The first category is pronunciation, or say the word. The students will see a word and must try to pronounce it correctly. You can click hear the answer to play an audio of the correct pronunciation, Manager. and then go back to the main board and award the points if they got it right. The second category is vocabulary. The students will hear a definition of the, the word. We use you can click reveal question if they need to read the definition. I normally take away some points for this, but that's up to you. Finally, click on answer to see the correct word. The third category is spelling. The students will hear a word and they have to try Arrive. and spell it correctly. You can click hear the word again or Arrive. hear the word in a phrase to help the students. They arrive Finally, click on answer to reveal the correct spelling. The fourth and final category is grammar. The students will see a phrase that has a grammatical mistake. They need to find the mistake and fix it. Click on answer to see the correction. When in teams, I always tell them, always tell them if the team is wrong, the other team can answer and steal the points. But again, that's up to you. Keep going through the board like this until you decide to stop or all the boxes are gone. Okay, I hope this helps to explain the game and please remember to check back for new videos on how to teach and learn English at coolenglish.net.